We've had so many comments from people. Um, Helen says, one ectopic pregnancy and traumatically delivering a stillborn baby have left me with severe depression, anxiety and very real signs of PTSD. Um, I receive no follow-up care or advice. Oh. Mental health is such a major issue, yet it's constantly ignored relating to, yeah. to miscarriage. Yeah. Well, you know Karen what, though, Ruth, said, I think that often... I know that we're often in the habit as women of not telling people that we're pregnant because we're superstitious. Mm. What if we lose the baby? But I could not have coped with my miscarriage carriages if my family and my close friends hadn't known because they'd shared in my joy mm -hmm. those and then if I'd just gone oh I was pregnant and now I've lost it and so they was upset and able to support me because they knew how happy I was and I think I think often but women are feeling very lonely if about... you have other children that are quite young it's quite tricky I think to involve them in a pregnancy well, that, I that then, Maddie and she helped yeah. and she was there at the burial and everything because because she would have felt all that sadness going on in the house and she wouldn't have known what it was about yeah. and so she, you know children accept things if you tell them they it do, in the right yeah. way I think yeah, well, yeah I'm so sorry I haven't got time to read all of these thank you very much for, for sharing them and most people the general gist is yes it's very traumatic yes they suffered with that and actually it never goes away, yeah. no. you were saying. It, you just learn to, to deal with it. one said ninth pregnancy that was her only surviving oh. baby, but she said that she felt her, mm. it healed the wounds. 